I am Shannon Grant. I am a Cincy Superstar Director with the team named Heaven Essence. And I wanted to make this video to tell you guys about our Bring Back My Bars that are here for June, all the way till the end of the month. Now, I just got them and I'm super excited. It's almost like Christmas all over. So I thought that I would tell you about these. Instead of you just reading what the names are, I was gonna explain them to you. So. I'm going to go over some of my favorites also, but I'm going to explain each one to you. So our first one that we have here is called Echo. This was in our men's line before it was retired, and this is an awesome scent. I have a lot of people coming to me at festivals looking for this scent. If you like business, casual, or simply irresistible, or any of those scents um, from the past, and business casual you can still get, you would love this. This is in your My Dear Watson, your Shaka, um, Atlas Cedar family, but this is amazing. It smells like a very, very fresh man. So this is called Echo, and I'm gonna read the description. It says, sophisticated metropolitan fragrance of manly spice, notes Mediterranean citrus, herbs, and bitter orange. And it smells amazing. So this is definitely one of my favorites, and I'm gonna be stocking up on this because people always come for this. The next one that I love is called Quiver. It was in our romance collection. And it smells like, to me, do you remember the Obsession Cologne? It smells a lot like that to me. Um, it really does um, last a really long time. This is one of my husband's favorite scents. He uses this in the laundry. He says it reminds him um, of when he bikes because he washes all of his biking clothes in it and then whenever he rides, he really smells the Quiver. So. This is a very, very nice scent that we still have in our laundry, but we do not have in the bar. So if you do want to get Quiver, it's only available until the end of June. So that's another one of my favorite scents. And the description of that one is an innocent vanilla flower, warm sandalwood, and sultry night blooming tuberose in a seductive scent meant to cause a shiver of delight. So that's really nice. Okay, so the next scent that I love is called Eucalyptus. Who doesn't like Eucalyptus? Oh wow, it just smells so fresh. And this is perfect for whenever you have a cold or if you just wanna have like a minty kind of um, eucalyptus-y kind of scent in the house. I really like this scent. Um, it's available also till the end of June, just like the rest of these. But the description of this one is a soothing, medicinal, and fresh. So like I said, a lot of people will put this in the baby's room or in their room whenever they have a cold or just for um, a fresh scent. Okay, the next scent that we have that a lot of people have been asking me for is called Hazelnut Latte. It smells like you're just walking into a coffee shop like Starbucks or Coffee Shack. Oh wow, makes me really, really hungry for a latte. Um, this one has a description of a frothy steamed milk, toasted hazelnuts, espresso, and vanilla with a dusting of cinnamon. This is really nice. But if, if you like those bakery kind of scents, this would be perfect for you. Okay, also another bakery scent. It's called French Toast. And this smells just like my grandmother used to make these. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Um, you can smell like the milk dipped into the cinnamon and the egg and oh wow, it's nice. Okay, so the description of this one is a perfect light slice of bread dunked in a golden egg batter dusted with powdered sugar and finished with a swirl of sweet maple syrup. So you guys that love bakery, you definitely want to get this. This is in that like salted caramel cupcake category. Okay, and then there's another one for bakery called Cutie Pie Cupcake. Now if you like um, birthday cakes and happy birthday scent and any of those, you're gonna like the Cutie Pie Cupcake. And the description for that one is a sweet clementine and yellow cake batter with vanilla and sugary icing. And I can smell the icing, I can smell the sugar and the vanilla. So if you like sugar cookie or any of those scents, this one's gonna definitely be for you. Okay, so now we have one called Bananarama. This is for my banana fans. This smells just like banana Laffy Taffy, if you remember that one. And the description is a sweet golden ripe banana. So yes, if you think of the Laffy Taffy we used to eat as kids, that's gonna be the scent for you. All right, our next scent is going to be Grapevine. And Grapevine, we've had a lot of great scents come out. There's Grape Bonita, and um, this one smells like, I like this one. This one's a little bit more, not as sweet, more grape. 
Um, the, let's see, the description for this one is somewhere between grape juice and Cabernet. I can see that. I can see the wine in this. This is nice. So this is called Grapevine if you like those grape scents. Okay. The next one, and this is funny. I have a funny story about this one. This one's called Bubblegum. And it smells just like bubblegum. It smells like bazooka, if you've ever had bazooka. And um, this is proof that these are non-toxic. My daughter actually popped out a little cube of these whenever she was younger and tried to eat it because he thought that it was bubble gum whenever this scent was around. And of course it's non-toxic, so it didn't bother her. But this smells just like bubble gum. This is a great kid's room scent, um, or if you like the scent of bubble gum. But the description for this one is a true scent of baseball card bubble gum, sugar and cotton candy and a hint of mint. And I can smell all that. It also smells like the big league bubble gum with the shredded bubble gum pieces. Okay, the next one that we have, Orange Dreamsicle. And if you remember those popsicles, those dreamsicles that we used to get also when we were younger, this one is just like that, even like the push-ups. So the scent of that one is, or the description is, a classic combination of fresh orange swirled with vanilla cream. That kind of explains itself. But if you smell this one, it's going to remind you of having those kind of popsicles. Okay, Strawberry Sweetie. These are for my strawberry fans. Wow, it's just like strawberry. Um, a fruity delight of strawberry sprinkled with sugar and vanilla. I can smell the sugar and the vanilla and strawberry. So this is going to be a very light strawberry scent. If you like like the perfectly pomegranate and the camu camu, this one's going to be for you. It's called Strawberry Sweetie. Okay, the next one is going to be Flower Shop. Now, I'm a, not a big floral fan, but this one, yeah. This one smells just like flowers. This is like a plethora of flowers. This is like um, roses and lilies and, um, gosh, a lot of them. Let's see what the description says. Um, just like walking into a flower shop. I can smell almost every flower that you could smell. It's like the green stem. It smells really, really fresh. So if you like flowers, this one is going to be for you. Now this scent reminds me of my grandmother's cold cream that she should put on her face every night before she went to bed. It's called Awakening. It's a very light, fresh scent. And um, it's very, very popular um, when it comes back. A lot of people were very upset whenever it disappeared. But it's called Awakening, and the description for it is an inv invigorate your senses with an unexpected harmony of white peach, vanilla, pineapple, and amber. And this one is just really, really fresh, like a bathroom, like um, a spring morning, but it really reminds me of my grandmother and her whole cream she used to put on her face. Okay, this one's called Enliven. This is going to be in your spa um, area. Maybe a little bit of men's sense also. Um... This one is called Enliven, like I said, wild orchid and renewing current blended with sweet soft fruit and a drop of coconut milk. And I can smell that. This smells really nice. It's going to be another light scent that if you like your spa scents, this one's going to be for you. Now, this is one of my favorite scents of all times called Flirtatious. And I probably have about 20 orders for this already. No kidding. I have let people know that um, it's coming back and they're so excited. But this is a very... I don't know how to explain it. It's very girly, I guess. Um, wow. It reminds me of when I first started since it was one of my favorite scents whenever that I got whenever I first started. But um, it is like the perfect scent if you want something that smells really, really good um, for your bathroom, for your bedroom, really anywhere. This is just a really fresh, um, really good scent. Okay. The description for that one is going to be... Fruity and vibrant, a combination of green apple, grapefruit, and white amber. So, I can smell the amber. I promise you, you will not be disappointed if you get flirtatious. And then the other one that everybody is almost knocking the door down for is called French Kiss. And I've already got a lot of orders for this too. And this is just an amazing scent. It's sweet fig, tenderly caressed by coconut pulp, exotic cedar, and caramel. And it is a, I call it a bedroom scent because it's like a, um, it's kind of a deep, a deep, not musky, but a deep scent. It has amber in it and it's just really, really nice for like a bedroom or um, like your living room area. But a lot of people like this. It was in our romance collection and it's called French Kiss. 
And then of course we have Love Story. And Love Story has been very popular. It's an innocent pink jasmine, sensual amber, embraced by luscious dark chocolate. And a lot of people got this in their hand creams whenever this was available, and it's not available anymore. So this one's called Love Story, and that's gonna be in your romance collection as well. And we only have a few more. And this one I got whenever I first started scentsy, and it's called Cashmere. And if you like newborn nursery or any powdery scents, this is a really good one. This is very strong. It's like a um, kind of a perfumey, powdery scent. It reminds me of a sophisticated woman is what that reminds me of. Um, and the detail or description of that is sheer floral bouquet combines Moroccan jasmine, lily of the valley, and bergamot. And that just really really smells good it's very fresh and it's very strong and it was in our romance collection as well and then the last one we have is called amber road and amber road is a very deep scent it's like a manly scent and open a box treasure handpicked from exotic lands to discover glowing red cedar and incense so that is like a Oh, it's in your sandalwood family it's the ones that people like the earthy scents that's a very good scent for them so I told you about all of these scents. They're available in your six packs for $25. You can get three for $14. You can buy them one for $5. They're available the whole month of June. And then they will um, go back into the vault, kind of like a Disney movie. So if you want to stock up on any of these, definitely go to my website or get in contact with me. And I can help you with that. But um, they are the top 20 cents that have been voted by customers and consultants from the last 11 years with Scentsy. And I hope you really enjoy them and I hope you enjoyed this video describing them. You have a wonderful day. Bye.